Well, hi there, you lovely fly fishing maniacs. Welcome to the Sameo channel. My name is Ken Persson, co-founder of Sameo Sweden. Well, it's after the holidays. 2019 season is here. I hope this season is going to be the best ever. Today I'm going to do something really different. I'm going to go look for a new fish mobile. My old car here, there's nothing wrong with it. It's a 11 year old Land Rover. I bought it just so I could have a good fishing car. And I have slept in it and it's still okay, but I'm old. And today I'm gonna go to meet up on a special shop for van conversions. So, tag along. As a kid I grew up by a stream and I have been fishing since I could walk upright. Even if I today kind of live the dream working together with my friends on a fly fishing company, the actual fishing day seems to be fewer the older I get, so I nurtured this dream of a nimble mobile office, a platform that I can use to get me to the spots where the weather, the hatches and the fishing conditions are at the best. I want to travel more from day to day without having to plan and book accommodation months ahead. I used to do that a couple of years ago in the old landing, but the hassle to load it up, organize it and to sleep in the back on an air mattress, well it works, but just for shorter trips and it's for one person only. So maybe with a comfortable van, I could get my wife to join me on some of my trips. That would be actually great. Rika Nilsson is an old buddy of mine that owns a company that specializes in camper van conversions. And he is the importer of Hussel in Sweden. When talking to him about my specific needs, he just said, pop down here to Pukavik and I show you many nice alternatives. It sounds like you could use a tinny. A plotis. Uh, they are extremely clever plant and more roomy than you'd expect from a small van. So here I am in the cold and sleet in Pukavik. Wow, it's almost too much to take in. The questions are bubbling in my head. Citroen builds versus Fiat chassis or maybe a Merc or Ford? And which length would suit my needs best? 640s, 540s, 600s? And how about all the other stuff? Solar panels, propane bottles, batteries, power converters. I don't know anything about these things. Extra thanks to you, Rickard, for your patience with me trying to sort things out. I want to be able to keep a pedalboard inside from time to time, and I want to have places for my Samio gear. You know, for demos, casting clinics, fishing trips and so on. I must be able to travel on narrow dirt roads and I must be able to turn the whole damn thing around on small tight spots. And if possible, I would love to have this as my daily driver. I think van life is gonna be something for me, really. Go fly fishing with home away from home, can do my videos. There's plenty of room for a stand-up paddleboard. It's plenty of room for my rods, reels, waders and whatnot. Could this be the next trout mobile? Who knows? What do you think? Imagine waking up by the water, fly fish until I get tired and just go to sleep. Okay, hopefully not with the fishes, but close by them. So what do you think? Sounds like a good idea? Should I buy one? Please let me know your thoughts. My head is spinning. And as usual, if you like this video, I want more, please hit the subscribe button. See ya!